Hello everyone and welcome back to another video and today is a little bit different. This is going to be a voiceover of some footage where you get to watch me ramble on about my achievement of 500 subscribers while getting to just chill and watch me play some Minecraft. So yeah, I'm not sure what the gameplay footage will, will look like, but I just kind of Wanted to have something for you to watch in the background while I kind of go through and explain everything. First off, oh my gosh, this is... I had been stuck at like 250-ish subscribers for so long. And then in the same year, I... I hit 400. Or I hit 300, then 400. Actually, I think I hit 300 a bit, like, late last year. I'm not entirely sure, but we hit 400 and then we hit 500 and that's that's insane. I I thought it was going to take I thought maybe I could get 500 by the end of the year, but oh my gosh, it, it's summertime and we hit 500 subscribers. So, I'm that that's amazing for me. I've I've come to kind of learn a lot about my video style lately and what I kind of want to do moving forward. I do want to do let's plays and I do want to do all like the tutorials and everything, but I think I really like to do mostly more of the tutorials and more of the gameplay showcases. I really enjoyed doing the Minecraft Xbox 360 in 2024 video. And I also, I, I my tutorial videos do like extremely well, and I, I realize that just because I know how to do something doesn't mean you guys know how to do something. So I'm gonna go ahead and share my knowledge that I know with you guys. I know a lot about Minecraft more than I think I should, honestly. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I, I would like to share that with you. Also, I find that everyone has their own style of gameplay so i really like to make more videos like the xbox 360 edition where we explore a different way to play minecraft that someone may enjoy more than just the default vanilla game so yeah i do want to play some other games but i think i want to kind of turn this more into a streaming just i want to stream the these games maybe do little edits but i think i want to do more uncut stuff i really think i like my slime rancher 2 stuff i think it could be a little bit edited because i know it's hard to just sit there and watch for like two hours so maybe i can kind of edit some of those longer parts out for you and you can kind of get the the gist of them yeah as for the terraria i'm gonna continue editing that'll be the one like edited series for right now yeah, anyway, enough of the discussing the videos and everything, but another thing that I've come to really enjoy and, you know, learn is I I want to create a community here. I've always kind of liked making videos, but recently I kind of have looked deeper into it, and at first it was just about hanging out with friends and, you know, Recording good time, recording my initial reactions to things, recording like moments, capturing those moments on camera of your friend dying unexpectedly and having a laughing fit about it. <laughs> but since becoming an adult, my friends that I did play with, they don't have the time anymore. They have all grown up and they've gone their own ways and they they don't have time to play games anymore so there's not I'm not able to capture those moments like I I was able to so I have kind of expanded out and I've joined Flappy MC's Discord and honestly that was one of the best decisions of my life <laughs> I I joined that Discord I wanted to put myself out there and meet some new people, make some new friends, and that went a lot more well than I thought it would. I joined that Discord and I was like, okay, I'm going to try and be active here and we'll see 
what what goes up but i was very much accepted and everything and i really really enjoy being a part of that community and it really made me think uh looking back on like hermitcraft or other minecraft youtubers i you know i liked watching their gameplay but i think what i really enjoyed more is just that they how they have built this community and they involve people and they really just involve their audience and everything i would like to do the same thing i have had a discord for a really long time i don't advertise it a lot but if you are looking for a community where you want to come play games, meet new people, and have a good time, share your creative ideas, go ahead and join my Discord. Link will, is always in the description. It always has been. It always will be. Also, really, the reason I found that other community was because I watched a video that really inspired me, and it was just like this one. 500 sub video <laughs> that really ran it home for me and so I joined I met a lot of awesome people okay and the community keeps growing and like we don't I mean there we do have people that are on here but that aren't as active but like a lot of people are pretty active here and I would say grown pretty close in the short time that we've known each other. I really want this video to be kind of a motivation for people to get a little bit out of their comfort zone, to go meet some new people, to create things, to share things, to be able to get past those people that tell you no, that don't care, that don't seem interested because what I have to say about that is that you have to find your right group of people those people will tell you that's awesome I'm impressed by that video that you made that's a cool looking thumbnail that's a great title for this video I think you had some really great moments in this video and also, hey, I think you should make a video on this. I'm like, okay, I didn't think about making a video on that because I thought this was something that everyone kind of knew how to do. No, that's the don't don't think that way. Okay, I I have thought that way before, and it has stopped me from making making some videos and stuff. But the thing is, there are people out there looking for this information, and you may be the only person that they can find to get that information from. I have this video idea that I, I'm not entirely, I'm not, I have no idea how to even execute it, but I know the title of it, and it's called Uploading My Brain to the Internet. Okay, and I've had this idea of like, what if my, or not the internet, but like YouTube specifically. So it'd be like uploading my brain to YouTube. And it just would like to put all my knowledge that's in my head onto YouTube for you guys to watch and enjoy. And the thing is, that's a, kind of an impossible task because I... I one have no idea how i would explain everything that i've learned or everything that i know and at the same time i'm learning so much more every single day so i just i'm learning faster than i would be able to produce videos on it but it's an idea that i've had and i think i think i might try to execute that video idea it has been in my mind for months at this point so yeah, I encourage everyone to go ahead and try and upload your brain to the internet. Upload your ideas, upload your creativity, do whatever you can. You are free to share it in my Discord. I would love to see that kind of stuff. I know there's a lot of talented people out there, and I know a lot of you think you're not that great. And 
you know, that's... That's how I am, too. I don't think I'm that great. But... I still like making the videos, and I put the videos out there, and I get people that tell me I do a great job, and I'm very underrated. I'm like, okay, I just made a video that, you know, I... I thought, like, could possibly help people, but, like, I don't know, I didn't think it was that big of a deal kind of thing. But for other people, it was a big deal. So, anyway, if you're listening to this, let me know what you think, and we'll see you in the next one.